as yard sales pop up all over the place around southern New England, a man from Warwick has put a unique twist on the concept with his craft. He's a familiar face on weekends while he waits in his driveway. NBC 10 Sam Reed shows us something good. Walking down his stairs at the age of 86. Put the light on. I want to show you something. Emil Plant of Warwick has a one of a kind man cave. Boy, I like it. I go down solo in my own will. Here in his home, he spends hundreds of hours working with wood. If you can't reach him, the phone's ringing, um, he's in the basement. In fact, over the years, his hobby has produced so many pieces. Yeah. Self taught all the way. That he's created a museum upstairs, showcasing his labor of love. I got all kinds of stuff. I always wanted to be a carpenter, I never was. Says, I like woodworking, and that's how I started it. But with so many creations over so many years. He couldn't let time roll by without offering others an opportunity. Right out there. <laughs> Yard sale. To purchase these pieces. For sale. His one-of-a-kind creations by Emil. Well, I give it to him at a good price. Like clockwork, weather dependent, and only on weekends. For about three hours, people passing by on Norwood Avenue are welcome to stop and make a purchase on the pavement. Everybody's after them, I don't know. His daughter, who lives next door, says watching him work has been wonderful in more ways than one. He absolutely loves it. People stop by and he talks with them, he chats with them. It makes him feel so good and they get so excited, which makes him excited. There's birdhouses and automobiles, all different styles and sizes. I do this instead of television. I don't watch television. During the work week, he works on them awaiting the weekend for customers to come. So what has the response been from people? Do they like your products? Or? Oh, do they ever? I sold out last week. That support means more than one could imagine. Keeps him going, gives him a purpose, you know. Even his neighbors pitched in with donations, like secondhand lumber. Well, I buy some and the neighbors give me their scrap wood from bureaus and stuff and I take it from there. Once it starts to get real cold, Emil says he'll call it quits, but in the meantime, he'll be out here. Feels good. I feel I made people happy. Rocking away in his chair while whistling a tune. <laughs> waiting to sell you something so sincere. <laughs> Do you think these are good Christmas gifts? Perfect. You want one? <laughs> Showing you something good. I'm Sam Reed. Those really are. I mean, the detail is incredible, and we don't blame him for not watching TV, right? Uh, Emil, can you just watch us, you know, keep us... <laughs> Occasionally keep, throw us a ball. Yeah, I was just say, keep us in business, and we'll go and buy a wooden toy. There yeah. you go, right? No, but that's incredible. And it's hard to find those anywhere, so those are unique gifts and from the heart. And I'm sure Sam posted the address, on, oh, yeah, if you I'm missed sure. it, on turn yeah. to 10com All right. If you want to show us something good, upload the pictures and videos using Chime In or turn to 10com or the app. We love the app. Coming up next at 6 o'clock.